Mum called again. She left you another voicemail. You should try getting out today. It might do you some good. You can't keep going on like this. You're going to have to get over it sometime. I feel like shit. That's understandable. It's not just that though, eh? It's my fault. And that, that's not just a sharing the burden thing. It's literally my fault. I, I should have been there. I was supposed to be there. Hey, you know, it's not just you. It was my party. I was the one that invited you. I, I should have just said no. If, if I'd said no and not been such a such a lazy prick, then maybe it'd be different. Maybe she wouldn't have had to walk. Maybe she'd... Maybe she'd... Maybe you should go home. I mean, it might do you some good. Probably shouldn't be alone at the moment. Station. Then I wouldn't have gotten killed and we wouldn't be having this conversation. Blah, blah, blah. You're beginning to sound like a broken record. Why are you doing this? Because you need to get over this and stop feeling sorry for yourself. You're not the one that's dead, you know. Oh, come on, Lisa, that's not fair. No, <laughs> three weeks. You've been moping around here doing nothing. You didn't even come to my funeral. I didn't think I was wanted. Look, this has to stop. You made a mistake. Nobody's denying that. I'm sure as hell not denying that. But Mum's calling because she loves you. Everyone will forgive you, but for that to happen, you need to forgive yourself. And like I said, I'm not going anywhere until you do, so... Do you think you can? Okay. Okay, I will. <laughs> 